What's up, world? Check this out. Got the kids. Hey. <laughs> We're about to try out Isaiah's new remote control cars that he got for his birthday. Uh, we've been trying them out in the house, but today we've got them at the church parking lot. There's a pavilion with super smooth concrete. So we're gonna check them out, roll them around, maybe ride some bikes, do some skateboarding, and have a good time. Right, dude? Yes. Yeah. Yoo! Yeah. Here we go. First integrity worship gig. Chill. <laughs> We're going out to um oh gosh, what's the name Let's of the see. I don't even know the name of the town. Mac we thought it was Tarboro. It's near Tarboro. It's like uh Macac Mac it's like Macacklesville or something. We're going there to a church called Webb's Chapel. And we're gonna go out and lead worship. Macclesfield. Mackles what? Macclesfield. Say that again. Macclesfield. Macclesfield. That's where we're going. Macclesfield, North Carolina. <laughs> we're gonna go play some songs. Gonna be fun. Here we go. You.
we just wrapped up an epic sesh <laughs> leading worship for the annual meeting. It was a blast. Now we're about to get the dinner of champions. Subway! So that means they're popular. Yeah, that's better. Wanna toast it? Oh, yes, please. All right, what's up world? I've got a big day planned today. Uh, I've got a full day of work in. We've got a men's conference at our church, so I gotta get everything ready to roll for that. But before that, I am gonna take some time this morning and get in a surf. And this is actually kind of a different day because I'm going all the way to Virginia Beach. Uh, it's not that much farther than uh, like Nags Head or something like that, but um, I'm meeting my buddy that I've never met in real life before, uh, Cliff, and he's an awesome worship leader and mentor, and so I'm going to meet up with him, have lunch, or rather have breakfast with him, but obviously before that, it's Virginia Beach, so I figured I'd get in a surf. So it is 3.30 in the morning, and I'm leaving to get out there by sunrise. Um, even though the waves don't look great, I've got the nine foot six, the longboard and the uh, paddleboard. So hopefully I'll be able to catch something on my first time on the water in Virginia Beach. So here we go, that's my day. Hope you enjoy it. Pew. not looking huge so I went back to the car grabbed the paddleboard um, worst case scenario it'll actually be decent when I'm out there and then I can go back and get the longboard but it's looking like a paddle kind of day that's all right I'm gonna have a blast the sunset is or the, sorry the sunrise is absolutely stunning out here so here we go Whew.
man, it wasn't a super long session, but I was out there for, uh, you know, about an hour and a half or so. Caught some decent waves on the paddleboard. I think I'm starting to like paddleboarding, like sup surfing, more than regular surfing. Is that heresy? Uh, gosh, I really love it. Well, let, I, I don't think I like it more because on bigger days, I think I would definitely still prefer to have my surfboard. But on days like today, man, like I was out there on my paddleboard and I caught, you know, 15, 20 waves maybe. And um, there were two dudes out there on longboards and they were, they were sitting almost the whole time. I mean, I think I saw the one guy catch five or six um so i don't know on days like today i definitely like the paddleboard better um on bigger days i i prefer regular surfing um but on days like today like man i'd rather catch 20 waves on a paddleboard than five waves and sit most of the time if that makes sense so that was cool. Um, Virginia Beach is awesome. Look at that. It's uh, super pretty up here. Um, it's definitely a different feel as far as like the water, uh, being in the water, being on the beach and stuff. It's right where I surfed today. It was right on a boardwalk. So it definitely feels a little bit different than like the North Carolina beaches that I'm used to. It feels more like a northern like New England style beach to me um, or even more of like a New Jersey kind of beach um, also the, the water was a lot colder than where I typically go um, and yeah I definitely needed every square inch of that 3-2 wetsuit because I would have been freezing without it um, so in that sense it definitely felt more like a northern beach um, smells kind of weird Virginia Beach I don't know, there's a lot of uh, like boats that had steam engines nearby that were doing some stuff in the water. I don't really know what they do, but I think it smelled kind of weird. Oh, shoot, that's the other thing. Oh my gosh, uh, I hope that the GoPro captured it. But when I was out there, I saw, I don't know, 10 dolphins or porpoises maybe. I really don't know the difference, but they were out there and they looked like dark gray dolphins um at first i saw a fin and freaked out but it's definitely dolphins and they were out there just going around and, um i didn't really see any of them jump but they were kind of peeking in and out of the water um at, at one point like one of them was maybe 10 feet from me which is crazy you know it's so crazy to see those things up close when we were in destin we went on a dolphin cruise and saw him from a boat, you know, and that, that was cool, but man, to be sitting uh, out there on a paddleboard, actually I was standing, so I really saw him well, but um, to be standing out there on a paddleboard and, and have a dolphin like 10 feet from you, man, what an experience. Part of me was a little bit afraid that one of them was gonna like try to jump up under my board and knock me off of it or something, but um, it was so pretty. Uh, they were so beautiful, such a cool, cool experience um i was kind of iffy about coming up here today to surf i was first just kind of thinking i maybe would just grab breakfast with my buddy and not worry about surfing but i'm so glad that i did the water was calm the waves were really smooth i caught plenty on the paddleboard and i got to paddle with dolphins today so man it has been a good morning and it's only 8:30. About to go to a diner with my boy Cliff Lambert, the man, the myth, the legendary worship leader. Him and I have yet to meet face to face, so we're gonna hang out for a little bit, get to know each other, and then I'm heading home after that. I got a full day of work ahead. 